Hello there. Welcome back to our workshop here at Howard Piano Industries. Um, today we're going to be sh uh, sharing some information about um, well, CA glue. Um, it's uh, it's a glue that uh, is, is good for the, the field when you're out uh, working on pianos because it has a very fast um, dry or set time and uh, therefore you can do repairs um, without having to wait for glues to uh, to, to cure and, and uh, dry um, so you can do a lot more repairs out on the field that um, you couldn't do without the uh, without the CA glue. So we're going to go through and show you the different some different kinds and talk about some different uh, types of repairs that are used um, in the in piano work uh, using CA glue. Um, uh, so we're going to start here first with uh, the most common type and this is the the super thin version of uh, the CA glue. It's almost the consistency of water um, and uh, so it it creeps into uh, cracks and crevices and, and is good for things such as um, fixing loose uh, tuning pins. Uh, that's probably the most common thing that I've used it for. Um, but you can also use it for uh, if you've got a loose hammer head uh, where the shank attaches to the head of the hammer. If that gets a little bit loose, um, you know, you can put this into um, to, to tighten that up and uh, uh, take away any knocking or uh, clicking noises from that. You can use it for loose bridge pins. Um, you know, if you've got a just a real slight uh, crack in a in a rib or a soundboard, um, you can put some of that in, and, and it'll take away the buzz that's caused by that. Um, so those are some some things that um, that you can use if you've got a if you've got a loose uh, spoon or um, back check post or or something like that uh, you can use that. So there, there's a number of different things and the things that I suggest there there you know it's not an exhaustive list. There are certainly other uh, repairs you can do with uh, with the CA glue um, as you start to use it and you see the effectiveness of it. Um, and uh, and just to let you know, we've got uh, four different sizes available: the two ounce, one ounce. Um, Half ounce, and then this is the three-quarter po pocket size. Um, uh, the, this is nice because it's got a screw-on top, which makes it a little bit safer in a tool bag. If it were to get knocked over or whatever, um, you don't have the risk of of it leaking out um, if the cap were to come off uh, because it screws on. These others have a have just a pop-on cap. Okay, so they they stay on pretty good, and I've used them in my tool bag, but uh, the pocket uh, version is is always nice to have um, to avoid those spills. Because if you, you don't want to get CA glue um, in your tool bag, because it's uh, it's um, it can be a messy thing. All right, good. So now moving on to the uh, medium viscosity um, of the CA glue. Uh, this is this is a little bit thicker. We call it the gap filling um, because it's uh, it's thicker than than the thin version, um, and is good for maybe things such as uh, gluing on uh, gluing. Um, a broken key stick, um, re-gluing jack flanges, uh, things like that, things that you need a little bit thicker glue. Um, and uh, so that, now of course, the, the thicker of of the versions that you use, the, the longer um, uh, set time. Okay, the super thin is, says one to three seconds. So it, it sets quite quickly. Okay, and so that's the nice thing about that. Um, the gap filling or medium viscosity says 5 to 15 seconds and then the um, the thick version okay which is what we have here that's the thickest and that says 10 to 25 seconds so um, you know as you get into thicker the thicker glues it's going to set and as you can see we're just talking about seconds so it's not like we're talking about what's oh, going to be 30 minutes to set or anything like that because again CA glue sets very quickly um, now we do also sell the accelerator which is this item here, and that um, that's if you, we need it to set even faster. So, for example, if you use um, the medium viscosity and you put it in and you want it to set quite quickly, uh, use the accelerator, and within just a couple, a few seconds, um, that glue will set. Okay, so um, don't use that if you need a little bit of... Uh, work time, okay, because that that won't give you any work time at all. So, uh, so those are those are some products. Now, one thing you want to is is wise to have if you if you buy the CA glue, is um, what's called the uncure or CA remover, okay, because um, CA glue is very strong. Um, it uh, you know if you glue something together that you don't want glued together, for example, maybe your fingers, um, you want to be able to get those apart. Um, 
so so this it's good to have um, the CA remover on hand uh, for uh, mishaps like that um, because uh, it will hold your fingers together and uh, you don't want to have to cut that glue apart if it's between your fingers. So um, the CA glue remover will actually dissolve the CA glue. If for some reason you use the CA glue uh, to glue key tops on, which um, I've never done, but um, some recommend using CA glue for key tops. Um, you know, you, you don't want to you don't want to get the CA glue remover on a key top because it will it, as it re dissolves um, the glue, it will also dissolve key tops or other plastic things like that. So, um, just keep that in mind as you're using um, the CA remover. Now, um, uh, we also re re uh, sell replacement tips for the bottles, just as um, because um, uh, sometimes the 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 tips can get clogged up. Um, just to be able to, because they come with a, such a fine, uh, fine point, um, you know, be, to be able to get into small areas, uh, sometimes those tips can get can get clogged up. So, uh, for the one ounce uh, or the half ounce, one ounce, and two ounce bottles, we sell uh, replacement caps. I think there's they come in sets of three that we sell them in, and then for the three quarter ounce. Uh, we also sell replacement caps in uh, sets of three as well. So, so those are um, those are available as well, and, and sometimes it's good to get those when you're buying the CA glue, and in order to have those available if you get a clogged cap. Um, the other thing is, um, even though they do have a f real fine tip, sometimes you'll want a little extender on the tip. Okay, these uh, these extender tips, uh, I think they come in a set of six. And uh, they're longer, so they'll um, so it's if you need to get get in, like for example, between tuning pins. Uh, sometimes it's good to have an extender cap, okay, and it so it just makes it longer, so you can get get in where you need to need to go um, with uh, with an extension tip on it, okay. As, as, and so those will fit again the half ounce, one ounce, and two ounce bottles, and then we have a separate item for extension tips uh, for the pocket CA, the three-quarter ounce pocket CA uh, glue bottles. Okay, so those are another item that's um, available. Uh, the last thing I'm going to show you here are um, some, we call them hypo-oilers or um, syringes um, that uh, can be used. We've got two different kinds. We've got this one with a, it's a, they're both, they're both bulb types, uh, type um, hypo-oilers. Uh, this one's got a standard tip, but though they've, they've both got very thin tips on the ends, but this one just has a has a more fine point and a little bit longer uh, nozzle at the end. So those those are available. I think they're in sets of three as well. So <clears throat> um, we have those available on our website, as well as all the glue and everything we've shown you here in this video. Um, they're they're very helpful glues to have um, when you're out in the field. Or want to do repairs that you need a quick setting glue. Um, so feel free to let us know if you have any questions. Otherwise, our website is howardpianoindustries.com.